Yeah, Jesse was up for this one. My goodness Jesse. Jesse denies Giovinco at the penalty spot. Goal. Aruti puts Dallas up 1-0. Huge save again from the birthday boy. Huge save from Jesse to keep things even. A few changes in the lineup. Jesse Gonzalez makes his return to the starting lineup. Anton Nednyakov picked up an injury in training and is replaced by Minor Figueroa. Also, we get a fun look of Jacory Hayes, Victor Ulo and Kellen Acosta in the midfield together. The weekend comes early as FC Dallas is back on the road for the first of three games in an eight-day stretch, starting with tonight's game at Toronto FC. The defending MLS Cup and Supporters Shield winners are still figuring themselves out a bit after their loss in the Champions League final a few weeks back. Toronto are coming off a big win last week over Orlando and will look to build off that. FC Dallas notes, the last time against Toronto. The two sides met once last season in Frisco and Dallas came out on top in one of their better performances of 2017 in a 3-1 win. Key player Mauro Diaz, we know how great he can be based off the last two games but Dallas will need a bigger performance out of him on the road tonight if they want to get any points. All time against TFC. FC Dallas is 9-2-5 against Toronto and 2-2-3 all time in MLS regular season matches played at BMO Field. Set piece issues. According to the club's game notes, FC Dallas has not scored on a set piece this season and FC Dallas has produced the fourth most corner kicks, 65 or 6.5 per match, in MLS. FC Dallas scored five set piece goals in 2017, but did not score on a set piece until the eighth match of the 2017 season. This will be FCD's 11th match of the 2018 season. Injury report out, Chris Reeves core muscle, questionable, none loan, Annabel Chale, LDU. Quintos Francis Atuahin, OKC Energy, Emma Tulumasi, OKC Energy, Adana Jareed, Ottawa, Jesus Ferreira, Tulsa Roughnecks, Brandon Cervania, Tulsa Roughnecks, Jordan Cano, OKC Energy, Toronto Notes, International Duty, GK, Alex Bono Injury Report, out, FJ. Watch with us.